okay so the first thing we are going to discuss is matrices and it is the plural of the word matrix and and matrix it's a definition i will write i just want to tell you the main points clear means i don't want to uh, go like each and every concept like that like i will tell you each and every concept but clear cut point i will tell you which is necessary for you a matrix is an ordered a rectangular array of numbers so matrix is an ordered a rectangular array of numbers or functions okay so rectangular array matlab rectangular arrangement let's say for example uh let's say minus 2 5 3 4 it's a rectangular arrangement right isn't it so yes, you can sir. see because it is length is there width is there but if i write like this 1 2 6 4 2 then suppose 7 is this a rectangular arrangement no it's not a rectangular arrangement no sir not a rectangular are so rectangular array matlab here you can see the length you can see at almost three units something like that but either to length utna utna nahi hai idhar bhi utna nahi hai so length either three two either be two either be with two two like that this kind of things like uh, another example minus 1 6 uh 2 plus i it can be anything complex numbers or cos x 5 0 sin square x 7 8 see this is a rectangular arrangement right or 1 plus x y square 8 plus i 2 0 0 you can see this is another rectangular arrangement so these are all rectangular arrangement of numbers or functions So, इसको हम बोलते हैं मेट्रिक्स बोलते हैं वी विल से दिस इज ए मेट्रिक सो ए मेट्रिक्स इज एन ऑर्डर्ड सो ऑर्डर इज इम्पोर्टेंट इन द वे द ऑर्डर वी राइट दिस इज द एक्चुअली दिस द फर्स्ट दिस वन इज नोन एज रो फर्स्ट रो हियर इज सेकेंड रो सो दिस इज फर्स्ट रो सेकेंड रो थर्ड रो एंड दिस वन इज फर्स्ट कॉलम दिस इज सेकेंड कॉलम लाइक दैट सो ए मेट्रिक्स इज a rectangular is an ordered rectangular arrangement of numbers or functions okay then this numbers or functions are called are called the elements elements or the entries of the matrix so you are you are studying a new concept abhi tak aapne suna nahi the matrix karke so you are studying a new concept matrix so matrix nothing but it is an ordered rectangular arrangement of numbers or functions okay so either aap dekhenge to four numbers minus 2 5 3 4 they are known as the elements isko bolte hai minus 2 is an element of this first matrix 5 is an element of the matrix then to 3 is an entry of the matrix or 4 is the entry of a matrix aise hum bol sakte hai the numbers or functions are called the elements nahi hai to entries elements bhi bolte hai usko entries bolte hai entries 
ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಸ್ನೇಹಿತ ಎಂಟ್ರಿ ಸ್ನೇಹಿತ ಮೆಂಬರ್ಸ್ ಐಸೆ ಬೋಲ್ತೆ ಹ್ಮ್ ವಿ ಅಭಿ ಮೆಟ್ರಿಕ್ಸ್ ಕೋ ನಾಮ ದೇನ ಪಡೆಗಾ ಕ್ಯೂಂಕಿ ಐಸೆ ತೋ ಹಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಕೋ ಕೈಸೆ ಕೋಯ್ ಬಿ ಚೀಸ್ ಐತ ಹಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಕೋ ದೋಡಾ ಸಾ ರೆಕ್ಟಾಂಗಲ್ ಐತೋ ಬಿ ಹಮ್ ಬೋಲ್ತೆ ರೆಕ್ಟಾಂಗಲ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ರೆಕ್ಟಾಂಗಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಸೈ ಡೈಮೆನ್ಷನ್ 3/5 ನೈ ತೋ 7/8 ಸೋ ರೆಕ್ಟಾಂಗಲ್ ಬೋಲೆಂಗೆ ತೋ ರೆಕ್ಟಾಂಗಲ್ ಕಾ ಲೆಂಗ್ ದನ್ ವಿತ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಆಫ್ ಎನಿ ನಂಬರ್ so we will give names so a recta we denote matrices using capital letters okay and you can see here the bracket we are using is you can see that close to bracket you can see that rectangular brackets so we give name we can give like okay you can give this as okay this is matrix a you can give this is matrix b you can give another name this is matrix c so like that we give capital letters to give names to matrices okay then idhar apne horizontal line of elements horizontal line of elements elements ka horizontal line so the second me bolenge to this is a horizontal line right isko bolte hai rows row row nahi to rows okay then vertical vertical line of elements isko bolte hai columns say for example either this is a 6 5 and this is a column understood so horizontal line of elements are known as rows vertical line of elements are known as columns so first one how many rows how many rows two rows correct and two columns isn't it second matrix b how many rows are there tell me 3 three rows are there how many columns are there 3 3 now third one c two rows two rows columns kitna columns kitna hai 3 3 3 okay so two rows and three columns so horizontal line of elements are known as rows vertical line of elements are known as columns okay clear now another concept i yes, want to tell you so order order of a matrix order of a matrix order of a matrix matlab uh suppose a matrix has m rows and n columns okay then we say it is a matrix of order m into n but it is read as read as m by n okay so number of rows so palen rows ka number bolega then by likhte hai x into but it is read as by number of columns so now they go for example i will give you some examples Minus two, four, six, seven, five, two, zero, minus one. You just tell me how many rows are there? Two rows. Two. Two rows. So two. How many columns? Four. 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 So we four. write. We we write. We say the order is two by four. 
so this is a matrix so you can give some other name if you want p it's a matrix of order 2 by 4 so abhi kya hoga usme se zyada clarity aayega they say when you say it's a rectangle of a dimension 5 by 7 so you understood that the length of the rectangle is 5 and the breadth is 7 in the same way when we say it's a matrix of order 2 by 4 we will understand that there is two rows in that matrix and four columns in that matrix matrix okay and uh, yes sir p q r s so another matrix i wrote say okay this is another matrix what is the order how many rows two two rows how many columns Two, two. So we write it as two by two. Okay. And uh, A, B, C, D, one zero minus one six, four seven, cos six, I cube. So another matrix I wrote R. So what is the order? Three by four. Three rows and four columns. So four three column. by four. Four. Okay. Yeah. Now. So. In an M by N matrix. नंबर ऑफ एलिमेंट्स कितना होगा अब मुझे बताओ कितना एलिमेंट्स हो सकते ऑर्डर एम बाई एन तो इट विल बी एम इंटू देखो टू इंटू टू बाई फोर टू इंटू फोर एट एलिमेंट देखो वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट एलिमेंट्स इधर देखो वन टू थ्री Four elements, two into two, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve elements. Three into four, twelve elements. So, in an M by N matrix, the number of elements is M into M N. 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 Okay. So I will just ask you one thing. Like, suppose, let order. Is equal to so order nine number of elements number of elements is equal to eighteen. So what is the order of that matrix? Three by six. थ्री बाई सिक्स हो सकते हैं सिक्स बाई सिक्स सिक्स बाई थ्री बाई नॉट सिक्स बाई थ्री भी हो सकते हैं राइट क्योंकि ये दोनों अलग अलग है फर्स्ट वन में थ्री रो है सिक्स कॉलम है सेकेंड वन में सिक्स रो है टू कॉलम है थ्री कॉलम है ठीक है थ्री सो इसके अलावा कोई पॉसिबल हाँ टू बाई नाइन हो सकते और नाइन बाई टू वन बाई एटीन या वन बाई एटीन वन रो एंड एटीन column or 18, 18 1 one column 1 so these are the possible orders understood yes sir okay so order of a matrix matlab we write the number of rows by number of columns if there is m rows and n columns we write it as m Into n, but re we read it as m by n, m by n. Okay. Now, so, आपको एक doubt आएगा जैसे sir ये five by one, five row, one column. ये कैसे होगा? Five row, one column मतलब only one column. So five rows से okay three, two, one, zero. देखो कितना एलिमेंट्स कितना रोस फर्स्ट रो 
second row third row fourth row fifth row five rows horizontal mm -hmm. one around as rows vertical kitna hai ek hi hai so this is 5 by 1 matrix idhar sahi idhar first row mein ek hi element hai that's okay second row mein ek hi element hai third row mein ek hi element fourth row mein only one element fifth row mein only one element so five rows are there horizontal ones are known as horizontal lines are known as rows vertically only one so that is one column so i say dikhega 5 by 1 so 1 by 5 hai to kaise dikhega one so row horizontal just like 5 uh, uh, minus 7 6 2 1 how many rows only one row this is the one row abhi columns dekho first column second column third column fourth column fifth column understood so 1 by 5 to aise dikhega see understood yes sir okay now i am going to write general matrix okay general matrix of order m by n aapko samajhne ke liye so isme se so uska matlab kitna is isme se hame pata chalega m rows n columns okay to ek simple example uske pehle batayenge aapko ek cheez samajhne ke liye 2 4 6 3 2 1 is this a matrix is this a matrix yes or no is this a matrix 2 4 6 3 2 yes, yes what is the order 2 by 3 2 by 3 so iska position aap bol sakte hai kya mujhe iska position That is first row, first column में आते हैं ना first row में भी आ रहे, first column में भी आ रहे, isn't it? First element of first so, row. So हम ऐसे लिखते हैं इसको represent ऐसे करते हैं, ये one one इसका मतलब first row, first column. First column. So fourth वाला कैसे आएगा? First row, second two column. column. So ये one two. Second column. ये आएगा ये वन थ्री फर्स्ट रो थर्ड कॉलम गॉड इट तो वैसे पोजिशन के हिसाब से हम लिख सकते हैं जैसे थ्री नेक्स्ट रो में थ्री आएगा ये टू वन सेकेंड रो फर्स्ट कॉलम नेक्स्ट आएगा टू टू सेकेंड रो सेकेंड कॉलम थ्री सॉरी टू थ्री थ्री सेकेंड रो थर्ड कॉलम इन जनरल इन जनरल हम एक एलिमेंट को ऐसे रिप्रेजेंट करते हैं ये आई जे दैट मीन्स आईथ रो जेत जे कॉलम कॉलम एलिमेंट कॉलम ओके ऐसे रिप्रेजेंट करते हैं ओके सो आपको कॉन्सेप्ट क्लियर हो गया क्या चेक करने के लिए फोर थ्री टू जीरो माइनस वन सिक्स टू जीरो जीरो माइनस सेवन फोर टेल मी वॉट इज ए थ्री थ्री एलिमेंट माइनस सेवन माइनस सेवन थर्ड रो सो थर्ड रो मतलब इधर दिस इज थर्ड रो third column this is third row first column third row second column third row third column so a33 is minus 7 so every element has a unique representation like this hmm? what is a 24 2 to this this 2 right yes sir. second row Fourth column, understood? Ye 
थ्री टू क्या आएगा जीरो जीरो दिस वन जीरो थर्ड रो सेकंड कॉलम सो इन जनरल दिस इज माय पॉइंट इन जनरल वी कैन रिप्रेजेंट एन एलिमेंट नए तो मेंबर नए तो एन एंट्री ऑफ ए मैट्रिक्स एस ए आई जे दैट इज यूनिक a33 mother only one element will be there. there is there won't be two three elements with a33 so a33 mother is a unique position so a ij matlab it is a unique position that is the intersection of the ith row and jth column okay so now so in general if you write a general i am going to write an m by n matrix so i say i go like it is One one, a one two, a one three. Last element क्या आएगा? First row तो होगा, right? A n n. N column yeah. n column है ना? So last column yes, क्या आएगा? Yes. N आएगा. A one n. Now second row, a two one, a two two, a Two three. I say Jake. Last A. A two n. Two n. Two n. And it will go on, go on, go on. And what will be our last row? M row, say na. So A. A n one. M one. M one. M one. Because M two row. Yes sir. Yes sir. First column. Yes sir. A M two row. Second column. A. इंपोर्टेंट हाउ टू राइट अभी इतना बड़ा लिखना नहीं आता है तो टू बाई थ्री टू बाई थ्री थ्री बाई फोर ऐसे कोई ऑर्डर देने के बाद आपको जनरल मेट्रिक्स लिखने के लिए बोला है तो आपको ये आइडिया समझ में आना चाहिए ए आई जे इम्पोर्टेंट इज दिस वन ए आई जे मतलब I to row J to column element. So in general, an M by N matrix can be represented using this. Okay. Or symbolically, we can write this. This you can give a name. This can give any name. This capital letters we usually used. So you can symbolically write it like this. This is equal to square bracket. Ke andar, A I J M by Yeah, this is symbolically written. Hai. The meaning of this is, A is a matrix of order m by n. Got it? Yes, sir. Yeah. Very good. So, so now we will do some questions based on what we have discussed till now. Then we will go to the. new concepts